Hello everybody. I have been asked many times now what has happened to the earlier films that I did with my old cameraman. The simple answer is I did not think the quality was quite good enough at the side of what we are producing now. I have decided to put a few of them back on air. The first one is Water Priory on a glorious sunny day. Not ideal but I thought the keeper pulled it out of the bag and put some stonking birds over the guns. Enjoy. I'd just like to tell you a little tale about uh, when we were at a charity shoot at Airwood House and the team was me, Dave Gary, Martin O'Leary, world champion, European champion, many, many titles, won everything really, one of the best shots in the world. And two lowly gamekeepers, Frank and Richard Croft. And we went on to this, uh, the first drive, and I said, I'll take these first, I can see if we can these, uh, these two or four minutes, wasn't it, Frank? I'll, Martin, I'll win the second spot. Whatever you miss, Dave, I'll take those. So I said, well, they, they won't get a shooting, the keepers. So Jed and Frank were in the third and the fourth. Uh, shout it full. I'm stood there waiting. Bang, 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 bang it. Couldn't see anything. We never shot. There were still four birds in the air, wasn't there, on the you? We never hit a thing. These lowly game keepers shot everything. <laughs> think about all the money you've raised, Frank. I remember being here on the first charity shoot you did here for Princess Trust. I think you raised something like 290,000, didn't you? We donated 300,000, yeah. Donated, yeah. Donated 300,000. And these, this never gets spoken about, does it? You never see anything online or anywhere in, in writing where, you know, that this has been done. drive when I'm out. Let them go past the What's them then? Road here. Tastes nice. Ah. <laughs> uh, get an itchy finger Martin. <laughs> few few churches, game chips. <laughs> Down there. Load behind them Dave.
Four bounces, and all the women's everything with four bounces. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah, we have a big variety of ages of different people that come beating here from in the early 20s up into the late 70s. <laughs> <laughs> this is this is all one of our new recruits this year. He's 74, is Dennis? Yes, sir, you're right. right. Yeah. serious drive than the last one that, that we did, although there were some very nice birds in the last one. Drive. If you'd notice this banking, it slopes to the top of those trees, it must be three or four hundred yards in distance. So it just gives you a scale of what type of bird uh, pork is, is, um, is capable of delivering. So hopefully they won't be that sunny, you know, the sun won't affect them that much and we should see some good birds. That ridge in front, I just get yeah, yeah, a bit of
It's nice to have my loader. He's a bit younger than Des, Peter. <laughs> Plus he's, uh, he's an experienced clay shot, so sometimes now and again he'll give me a nudge and you're behind or you're in front. <laughs> I can't help Dave carry very much, I'm afraid. <laughs> Go back, go back. Come on. Come on. Number eight, Susan. Right at the very end. Eddie's gallery, uh, one of Water's premier drives. Uh, it's a bit affected by it, some by it look of it, so we'll just see how it goes. But usually, it's a fantastic drive, sun or rain or blow. So let's uh, let's see if we can see some nice birds and hopefully shoot a few. Because I'm not getting paid. They get paid, you see. No. Because yeah. it looks like they're enjoying themselves. <laughs> it was down, down on the Somerset level. Sure. <laughs> 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 She's reading. Yeah. Just back on the left. Yeah, just, just, just get a film of the of a keeper under pressure. You know. <laughs> yeah, we're going to do a drive now called Manadale. Uh, we've had a difficult morning, very sunny, but hopefully this will go a lot better. I'll go around the corner for an hour. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, this is um, Manadale. Uh, lo another lovely drive. 
it's clouded over now, so we should see some bloody good birds here. There'll be a, I think there'll be a fair amount of partridge in here. It's a gentle slope, but see the tree line? This slope, it, it continues after the tree line, it carries on. So there will be some, some tremendous birds coming from the back end of the drive, rather, rather than the start of the drive. So, but hopefully, now the sun's gone in, we should see some bloody tall birds coming off of here. Jonathan just mentioned the new gun, the uh, the MK60 crossover with the MK38 trap gun, uh, and I'm finding it. I'm shooting some good birds with it. Uh, it was a bit strange uh, at, at the uh, the first the first drive, and that was just getting used to the lightness of the battles. Uh, it seemed to be moving a little bit faster, but I've got used to that now. And uh, yes, it's a, a lovely gun, and it's doing its job. I'm looking for a nice uh, brace of partridge or brace of pheasants even and, uh, and then I'm going to cook tonight for my dinner. Got him. Right, right. Jamming. You only got right. Well, they're sticking them, then, Pete. They're bloody wordy, big style, yeah. Bastard things. But not fine, fine, yeah. Fucking uh, <laughs> hell. I thought you lost it then, Dave, at the beginning. <laughs> He's there, Thomas, with his little dog Yeah, today has been a, a, a very difficult day for us. It's been a hot, sunny day, very, very bright sunshine, which the first two drives went okay. Uh, but they, they certainly weren't uh, what we usually provide. But the guns have been very good, there's been no low bed shots. Um, and the last two drives have been fantastic. Really down to the hard work of the team, and especially all the beaters, and everybody else has put 110% uh, effort in today. Blacksmith, what would you call him? Silver one, no. Thank <laughs> you. 